Uh, oh yeah, that's definitely one. I think it's completely capsized. Dude, that's so cool. Want to keep up with the latest Komodo gaming videos? Be sure to subscribe and click that bell. Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Stormworks Build and Rescue. And folks, we are back once again, and today we have a treat. So today we're going to be checking out Shipwrecks in Stormworks. So there's a new environmental mod update. It's been out for about a week now, and it makes it to where you can spawn in buildings into Stormworks without having to actually manually spawn them in by via mission and we have two sets of missions here we have one by aqua and one by stuntman mike and they spawn some really cool shipwrecks around the uh, stormworks islands so one of the missions is actually a, a rather big boat it's called the ss american star and you can actually go on the inside and check it out so I always have a lot of people ask me like Komodo you gotta sink a ship and then go down and check out the shipwreck which we've tried it a couple times but as you know ships get really laggy when they hit the bottom of the ocean so I figured this is a good alternative to doing that so anyways we are arriving at the first set of shipwrecks these are actually two that are right next to each other oh that looks pretty cool uh, let's go ahead and look down oh uh, yeah so Anyways, we're going to be doing this here today. If you guys have any suggestions for future episodes of Stormworks, comment below. And if you're enjoying this series on the channel, maybe hit that thumbs up button. It helps out my channel. And let's go check out these shipwrecks. All right, we need to start losing some altitude. By the way, we're uh, actually in a GB Danny helicopter. This thing is pretty amazing. Really easy to use. Uh, very accessible. And, uh-oh, we're going down pretty quick here. Should we try to land on the uh, shipwreck? Oh, dude, look at that. The thing is absolutely, uh, ooh, it's actually really dirty. I guess it's rusty. It almost looks like somebody pooped all over it, but oh, let's go over here. So, yeah, we can actually go inside of this thing. That's what I'm really excited for. Now, you're seeing another shipwreck on the beach. That's a part of the Aqua uh, mission set, which I think there's like seven shipwrecks, if I'm not mistaken. We'll probably go search for one of them here in a second, but we've got these two to check out real quick. So, oh. Can't believe we're actually going to land on this. No, that's not going to work. That back wheel is not going to touch. We should probably land on the beach or something. All right, here we go. And touch down. Uh, I really hope there's a wheel break or something here. Uh, yeah, you know, I think we're good. Now let's go ahead and turn that off there and lose that. Are we rolling? Uh, we are rolling a little bit. There's... Bound to be like a wheel break or something around here somewhere. Eh, this is totally fine. It'll eventually stop. We should be able to take it back off. Oh, man, it's a nice looking helicopter. So, yeah, this will be cool if you guys spawn, like, say, the Aqua set. Uh, you'll be able to go find shipwrecks uh, all over the islands. And, ooh, well, that's something. This thing is completely broken in half. That is cool looking. So, yeah, we've got this one. Let's go ahead and go inside real quick, which I think we can. Uh, looks like it's pretty empty, but you can see there's holes in it. Man, this one would make for probably some really cool uh, ghost ship episodes. All right, let's walk through here. Try not to fall down in the engine here. All right, that's pretty cool. I think I just fell down in the engine. Oh, no. Okay, I might have just locked myself inside of a, a shipwreck. Uh, that's, that's not good. How did I manage to do this? Uh, oh, okay. Let me see if I can pull myself out here. Come on. You know, thankfully, the island spawn is, like, right here because I think I just locked myself in. Uh, let's go and quick spawn or quick travel over here. All right. So you have that. I don't know what the other aqua ships look like. Uh, no telling. Maybe it's a bunch of different models or I don't know if it's the same model, but I really want to go on the inside of this uh, American Star here. All right. So here is the SS American Star. Ooh, the huge hole in the side of it. How do we get into this shipwreck here uh oh uh do these still work oh they do okay oh now this is what i'm talking about this is cool looking you know what let's see let's maybe try this at night i know the uh the creator of the mission said it looks really cool at night now there's also a, a little bit of lighting you can activate here oh this would be perfect for ghost ship Okay, let's see. Do these still work? Yeah, all this still works. Uh, looks like we're in 
maybe a cabin area hold on let's see if we can get up to the tops somehow that's the side doors uh is there a way into this door back here nope okay gotta find a uh, set of stairs or a ladder on this oh here we go all right so yeah we can walk up this so it takes a little bit to navigate this thing because uh, obviously it's a shipwreck so you're going to do a bit of jumping and uh, maybe a bit of ducking here uh let's see so it looks like we're still in cabins uh yeah let's just keep going up the stairs maybe we can get to the bridge and maybe activate some of that temporary lighting by the way that noise you're hearing is actually the helicopter uh, oh, this actually looks a little bit different. We've got big openings on the sides. I wonder, is this actually a full ship somewhere? I need to check the workshop. It might actually be a, an item on this person's workshop, which that would be kind of cool. Ooh. Uh, let's see. Hold on. Let's go back up here. All right, I feel like we're close to maybe the bridge. What's this? Oh, is this the temporary lighting button? I think it is. Hold on. Let's go into photo mode here. Ah, there we go. You got a little bit of lighting. Uh, it's still probably pretty hard for you guys to see. Let's go ahead and go back uh, to daylight here. So let's go photo mode. All right. And is there... Oh, there is a bridge and stuff. You can see it through here. There's also more lighting, it looks like. How do we get up on the deck? Uh, looks like the cargo... Oh. Oh, that would be a devastating fall. Hold on. Does this lead out to where I am? Uh, I... I think there's a chance I can get to here or get to the front from here. Uh, let's see. Is there a, let's see if I could trick the button. I think there's a button on the other side of this door. Um, hold on. Let's see if we can find a way up on deck. Ah, right, here we go. So we can go up the side. All right. So looks like we're on one of the decks. I wonder how this thing sank. I mean, obviously the back half of the ship's gone. So <laughs> no telling, huh? Does this lead to the deck? Here we go. Oh, that looks cool. And one of the cool things about the environmental mods is the whole fact that these buildings, they don't seem to lag. I mean, because technically this is a building on the map. It's not a loose object. Like, I couldn't run a ship into this uh, into this thing and knock it over. Which, by the way, we're going to also check out... Uh, there's like a fire station that's been made in the same way. Uh, so we'll check that out here in a second. All right, that's a big empty area. Is there a ladder to get up to the bridge, potentially, or a staircase that's still intact somewhere? Uh, there's got to be one around here somewhere. And I wonder if I could parkour my way up to the bridge. Like, look at this. Run, run, run. Okay, get up on this. And then... Oop, there we go. That's how you traverse a shipwreck. So, here's the bridge. You know, it'd be something if it's still fired. Uh, Yeah, I don't think we're getting any fire out of this one. Uh, let's see we got another oh here's another button here there we go got a little bit more lighting that's cool that's really really cool looking so we can go here let's go ahead and change it to what does this look like at night now yeah it's like just enough lighting where it's creepy when you're walking around on it but that's uh that's definitely pretty cool to see so that's two of the shipwrecks there now like i said the aqua pack has quite a few more so if you guys want to download it and go actually find them there's like i think it kind of tells you where the locations are but you still can't locate it like via mission how you can toggle the uh, locations you have to actually manually go find it so that's just one of them there and then of course you have the ss america star which that's pretty cool all right let's go ahead and load up here i kind of want to go find one more let me see if we have one that's close by potentially all right, so we're back up in the air. Now, I've got a couple more locations that I think... Actually, I don't know if I have any of them here. There's potentially... No, that looks like a hospital island. I need to find some of the uninhabited islands because that's where it seems like a lot of these shipwrecks are going to be. Uh, there's some rock formations. You know, there's a ton of islands over there. There's bound to be another shipwreck. I'm kind of curious, though. I wonder if some of these are underwater. Like, that would be pretty cool. Uh, especially, you know, if there's like a really big one, kind of like the uh, America Star, like that would be sweet. Or if somebody could like, even sink the Titanic and stick it underwater and make it like a building, that would be awesome to explore. So we're going to head. Yeah, one of these has got to be maybe one of the uninhabited islands. Let's see that. Eh, these might all actually have something on it. I don't know. 
Go ahead and punch in a GPS waypoint. Let's go locate some more shipwrecks. Oh, uh oh. Okay, we good? Are we good? Uh, okay, let's let's turn that off real quick. Okay, maybe turn off. Uh, I think I just broke. So okay, turn off maybe the gyro. Ooh, ooh, ooh! No, 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 no! No, this isn't okay. Uh, so I think I freaked this thing out. Okay, let's try this again. Ooh. Oh, oh! So I freaked something out in the helicopter. This is no, oh, this isn't good. Well, we're about to be <laughs> we're about to be a shipwreck. Well, I guess a plane or helicopter crash um well that was that was something uh yeah so the helicopter just freaked out on me um <laughs> well we're kind of near an island here but that's a sub island uh, i guess i could do this via boat all right we are back up in the air after the uh, unfortunate accident i almost think maybe one of those shipwrecks was cursed or something <laughs> and wound up getting us killed so we're good though uh we're heading out to the islands once again Hoping that we locate something down here. I just want to find one more shipwreck. Uh, the first two were just easy mode because they were at the creative island. But the other ones seem to be in spots that might be a little harder to find. All right. One of these islands is bound to have a shipwreck on it. I've got about four in view. Wait a minute. There might be something on that one over there, potentially. Um, we'll check this one in front. Also, do remember, look in the water. Just in case. What island is this? This has got to be one of the uninhabited islands. I don't think this is a base island. So there's a potential that it's on the other side of this. Let's go ahead. Turn off GPS. By the way, I figured out what I did last time. Uh, the reason the helicopter freaked out, I don't think you can be above a certain throttle percentage and turn the GPS on and off. It seems to freak it out a bit. All right. Here we are. Uh, there's something on the island. I think it might be a crate or something. Uh, no ship crash. Nope, no shipwreck here. All right. You know, this island over here is really close. Real shallow water through here, so I'm making sure there's not a boat somewhere. Watch me miss it. Watch it be on video, and somebody in the comments section is going to spot it and be like, uh, Komodo, you dingus, you missed it. There's something on the other side of this island here. So let's check this one out. I think the Lighthouse Island also potentially has a shipwreck, too. All right, this island appears to be empty. Okay. Guess we need to move. Actually, these two islands are the same island here. So I'm assuming there won't be one there. But if we aim this way, uh, there's an island potentially. Yeah, there's one up north of here. So maybe we'll try to go to it. All right, folks, I think we have located another shipwreck. Uh, oh yeah, that's definitely one. I think it's completely capsized. Dude, that's so cool. Alright, let's go ahead. We're gonna get low. There hopefully is a place I can land on this island. Uh, yeah, I think I can land on the top of this thing. Alright, yep, that's definitely one. Okay, so it's really cool. They are different. Uh, you know, we might actually land on it. Uh, I think I could touch down on the beach here. All right, here we go. Touching down. Ooh, and touchdown. Uh-oh, that was... Okay, that was a little bit of a messy landing, but, you know, it's fine. Turn that off. Turn that. Turn that off. We are rolling right now. There we go. Kill that. Open the door. Jump out. Oh, don't get killed by the blades. That would be very embarrassing. By the way, I don't think this helicopter is supposed to float. All right, so here we go. We got another shipwreck. And... Yeah, this one is really buried in the sand. Oh, and we can see down in it. Can we get into this thing? Or is it hollowed out? I don't know if this is safe. Oh, we're in it. Dude, this one looks pretty cool. So, oh yeah, this thing's completely, like the top of it's gone. It is buried in the sand. So there is not much to this one. It is, uh, yeah, I can see that where the engine is. There's a battery or something up in the top. Oh, let's go ahead and see if we can hop out. Ooh, please be able to hop out. There we go. Uh, oh yeah, this thing is gone. Well, it's a little smaller ship than what was on the uh, creative island, but still we found one. And it's neat that you can spawn in stuff like this. So I think next we're going to check out one more building. Of course, there are plenty more shipwrecks. Like I said, I strongly suggest you guys go check them out. But I've got one more thing I want to check out. So speaking of structures, this is another cool thing that I think you can incorporate into the environment mod. 
And check this out. We can have stuff like this. Uh, we're at the Harrison Airport on the uh, Sawyer Islands. And we have a full-blown fire station. Like, this is exciting because I love seeing buildings in Stormworks. And it's something you really didn't see a whole lot of. But now that you have this environmental mod thing, that this is actually going to probably make this a lot easier. That way you can have a bunch of buildings already spawned in and ready to go for you guys to work. And dude, this is cool, huh? Let's go in this side first. So, man, even in like career mode, if you can spawn something like this in, you'd have like your own little base here. The lights are on. Got a little TV here. Uh, nice little living quarters. I can go back. Looks like we have the beds here. Oh, we can turn that on there. And then we can walk out this way. What's this? Uh, fans. Not. Uh, I guess we could turn the fans on. Is this like... Wait. I hear fans. Oh. So we have central heating and air? Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay, that's a new feature. So yeah, you can walk into here. Looks like you have all your, uh, your fire gear. You could definitely pull some... Uh, fire trucks in here which i'm pretty sure sheepdog has some more of these so yeah we got that where does this go uh we have like a little tower up here is this more living quarters uh i see a pole ah uh, this is like an hq here and it looks like you could probably hook cameras up uh using the radios so you can maybe have these at the towns and you can monitor them dude that is so cool you've got radios down here yeah buddy haunt slide down the pole and yeah we could totally get out fight some fires are there gas tanks see there's a water tank here what about fuel so maybe potentially out here uh i don't know if this one's got a fuel station but that's another thing that you could spawn in now maybe you can uh spawn in some sort of fuel tanks there's potentially one on this let me look around back real quick no i think all i see is the water tanks but yeah you can refill your fire trucks in here uh let me double actually that door doesn't seem to be working let's go back over here you got these little drop downs that might be actually that might be water that might be electricity i'm not really 100 percent sure but yeah this is definitely something that's really really cool to see in stormworks but yeah thought we would check that out oh there's your little alarm bell and time to go fight some fires apparently except for the fact i don't have a fire uh truck in here but still nonetheless very cool creations very cool to see this update so definitely go download, check some of this stuff out. Let me know down in the comment section below if you guys find uh, some more of those shipwrecks. Yeah, thank you guys for all the love and support. And we will see you guys next time in Stormworks.